I did choose for the salsas. I got half mild and then half pineapple. So yes, pineapple does belong on burritos. <laughs> Hey everybody and welcome to another food challenge video. Today I am in St. John's, Michigan, which is near the Lansing, Michigan area, the capital of Michigan. I am at the Crave Shack, about to attempt their big kahuna burrito challenge. This burrito challenge looks absolutely delicious. It consists of like three different meats, rice, two different types of beans, tons of toppings, uh, and this burrito weighs in over five pounds. You have one hour to complete it. If you do, you get the meal for free. You get a t-shirt and you get to sign their wall of fame, which is like a surfboard from what I understand. I believe there's been three previous winners and the record time is like 40-ish minutes or somewhere around there. So I've been craving a really good burrito and I've heard this place is really good. So this one is definitely going to be delicious. I just know it. So about to go inside and check the place out. If you want me to start, I will. No, it's totally up to you. I, 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 I think I think we'll go ahead. Just tell me when. Okay. Ready, steady, go. All right. Grape sauce is really good. It's like a garlic parmesan. Trying to get the hard part out of the way first. Seven minutes in. Can't even taste the sour cream.
Hey everyone and welcome back to another food challenge video. Today I'm in St. John's, Michigan at the Crave Shack taking on their Big Kahuna Burrito Challenge. This is a 5 plus pound burrito filled with chicken, ground beef, pulled pork, beans, cheese, lettuce, tomatoes, onions, salsa, sour cream, and their Crave sauce. This burrito is absolutely flavorful which made it very easy to eat. Burrito challenges are one of my favorite types of challenges and this one could possibly be my favorite tasting of all the burritos I have attempted. The strategy was simple. Eat some of the filling first, then work on the tortillas, and continue with the filling. This was a very fun challenge and the staff at the restaurant made it even better. The entire staff was pulling for me to win this challenge, so I didn't want to disappoint. If you're ever in the St. John's area, please stop by here and try a meal. Tell the staff I sent you. This place is filled with good people and amazing tasting food. Continue watching to see if I can manage to finish within the hour and potentially break the old record of 40 minutes. Woo! We're almost there. So there you saw it. I finished the Big Kahuna Burrito at the Crave Shack in St. John's, Michigan. I finished in 11 minutes and five seconds to set the new record. For winning, I got the $30 burrito for free. I got a cool t-shirt to add to my collection. And I got to sign their cool surfboard with my name and date that I completed it. And also put my time in there. This place uh, used to be a food truck. And then they purchased this uh, building and opened a restaurant. I have got to say that may have been the best burrito I have ever ate. It was very, very good. Um, I did choose for the salsas. I got half mild and then half pineapple. So yes, pineapple does belong on burritos. You know me, I love pineapple. But the three different meats on there just blended perfectly. I really liked all of them. I don't even know which one was my favorite to be honest, but uh, that sauce that they had on it, the Crave sauce was also very, very delicious. You're in the area, Lansing, St. John's, Michigan. Come check this place out. They are only open Monday through Friday, so make sure you plan accordingly. If you're feeling daring, see if you can try this challenge, the Big Kahuna Burrito. You've got one hour to do it. If you don't, it's 30 bucks. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you at the next video.